Welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing a continuation of our last video and this is going to be five things we love about Subaru, specifically our WRXs. 97% of Subaru vehicles sold in the last 10 years are still on the road. Love. It's what makes Subaru, Subaru. I'll start. Five things I love. I would say there's so many different options for customization. Like, it's endless. Yeah. So, there, there's aftermarket parts for everybody, no matter what style you like. So my first thing is I love the sound of Subarus, just like that CB Rumble. Even stock, I just love the sound and throw an exhaust on it and it sounds 10 times better and i just love it they're deep yeah i mean the rumbles sti but no but still, still the wrx is... you can even like tell like if you hear subi driving by you're like oh it's a subi like you can just tell the community like it's a great community everybody's welcoming and uh they appreciate everyone else's builds i guess yeah we've met a lot of great people through the <clears throat> Subaru community so we're very grateful for that my next one kind of builds off of that i'd say i love the subi wave just every subaru owner for the most part will wave back to you and I just love that so much. Um, I guess I also had the sound. So those kind of go hand in hand with yours. You can do your um, Affordable. I think, I mean, we both worked pretty hard to get our cars by ourselves at a pretty young age. So I think if you, if you work hard enough, they're very achievable to get, um, especially if you wanted to start smaller and get like a BRZ or something. Yeah. So I think they're very affordable for uh, the younger people who want to get into cars. Yeah, mine kind of kind of goes along with that. When I was looking for cars, I wanted something practical. I wanted something that was all-wheel drive, I wanted something that had a lot of space, and I wanted something that, like you said, was affordable. So when I found out about the WRX, which I knew about before, but I started looking into them, I was like, oh, this is perfect. You know, like, I get the space, the all-wheel drive, everything, like, that just sounds like the way to go for me. So at the time when I was looking into cars, I was snowboarding like I do now, but I was always taking my friends to the slopes, and we never had enough room for boards and people. So it was nice with the Subarus, I had a roof rack on top for all of our boards, and I still had enough space in the car for my friends, which was a huge plus for me, so I can't say that's the same with every car. And they're, yeah, like space-wise, they are very big. Yeah, practical. I mean, I moved across the country in this car. I had yeah. my entire life packed into this car. You moved countries Yeah. in yours. So they do have a lot of space. It's a family and car can be family sports car and then i think my last one is if you choose to get the sport tech or limited yeah no, premium premium is the top one in this yeah so premium yeah so i think my last one if you choose to get the sport tech or the premium in the states uh the sound system it comes with it upgrades you to the Harman Kardon sound system which I like I would never change the sound system in my car it is very good there's I don't know if you can see it a sub 
right there. So there's a subwoofer built in um, and just way better speakers and stuff. And it is like a really good yeah, sound system. It's way better than mine. So I think that's a big bonus to uh, upgrading to the higher trim level is yeah. the sound system. I definitely wish I did that. So that's what I was talking about. That's the subwoofer. So it comes stock like that on the premium and sport tech. And then it's easier to see on your side. It comes with a full Harman Kardon sound system throughout the entire car, which sounds amazing. My, what was my last thing? Oh, value. My last thing is probably a big one for me is that the Super WXs, they hold value especially right now since the 2022 came out um unlike adam some of us actually might sell their car in the future down the road for a faster car no offense but um it's nice to know even after driving it and modding and everything like it still has the same value if not is worth more now even after driving it for so long Still love Subaru.